Hello, this is Olympia and welcome back to another video. I know we have to find some stuff in Jorvik. I did read the article today. I don't usually read them. I just kind of like go for it and then struggle. <laughs> Before we go talk to Micah, let's go have a look at the rainbows. Well, that isn't weird, is it? You know what? I'm going to go do the... Actually, no, I don't want to do the... I was going to go do the rainbow uh, race, but I might have to do it to get a fragment or whatever for the... I'm glad to see you again, Olympia. You won't believe this. I don't remember what voice I gave her. This is going to be interesting. It would be easier to s if you see it for yourself. Follow me. As you can see, some colours are missing again, but this time it's only affecting the rainbows. I wonder what happened to cause this. Can you think of anything? Katya, maybe? <laughs> Will you keep an eye out for her, Olympia? Just be careful. But most importantly, we need to fix the rainbows. I hate Joe Micah's voice. Situation considered. Ready for next step. What? That wasn't even, like, grammatically correct. Well, it worked once. Do you think you could work again? Rainbow fragments. Sure. I sure we can't hire a painter. That is a hilarious choice. I'm gonna do it. We need seven rainbow fragments this time. She just completely ignored me. You won't believe this. I managed to lose my equipment again. Dude, can you stop doing that, please? Do I need to read both of them? Okay, if I go up to the top and read that one again as well. Yes, day two completed. Ooh. I'm very confused. I hate the book one. I can never do it. All right, let's get the horseshoes going again. You found a rainbow fragment. I did. Oh, we're going the same direction again. With like yellow, green, whatever. I still can't do this book one. I hate the book one so much. Is there another book I have to read? There's one more horseshoe and then I'm going to go for lunch. So then I'll stop recording and I'll come back after lunch. And Okay. Here's a rainbow fragment to Micah. I don't really know what that was for, but okay. Down we go. There we go. 240 horse, what, 250 horse XP. Okay. Now that I've done the horseshoes, now I can go get lunch because I am starving. I want to go take this thing to Micah though, because otherwise I shall have to do it again and I don't want to do it again. So I'll go take it to Micah. Okay. Don't know what that was, but okay. Why don't you return to entrance? Oh my god. Sometimes I'm really thick. Restore the green. It's the same order as last time. Oh, that's really weird. I'm back from lunch. So, I guess we'll go up to Micah and get that quest again. Because I had to quit when I didn't hadn't finish it. So I guess we'll go do that first. Why do they always do it as like 10,000 shillings? I mean, it's all ugly anyway, so doesn't really. I don't really care, but you know, it would be nice if they weren't all like ten thousand shillings. And they were more affordable. Okay, music notes. Let's go follow the music notes again. Do I be really annoying again, or do I not? <laughs> I annoyed myself with that. I can't find another music note. Oh, it's giving me a circle. Okay, nice. Okay, you found the source of the music. <clears throat> Open the playlist. This is a clever tri trick. She's looping her track Dark Riders to interfere with the weather. Easy. I'll choose a different song from the playlist. Glue Man, Hollywoods, or In the Heart of Everyone. Uh, let's do Hollywoods. Not quite the vibe needed here. Okay. Fine. We'll pick the one that you wanted. You saw the summer weather. I love doing quests on camera because it just feels like I'm just kind of going, I have no idea what I'm doing over and over and over. What are the final two? Lost gear, missing fragment. Oh, do you like books? I can't do the do you like books one. It won't do it. It won't. How am I meant to do this if it won't give me the fragment? I forgot they had these horses back. Another one of my has lost items and she lost her books. I guess she lost three of them in a pile. Did she tie them together? Probably not. 
if you tie them together, maybe she might have tied down her books onto her balloon in the first place. I didn't needlessly roast a lot of NPCs in Star Stable. <laughs> I feel sorry for them. They don't deserve it. I have one more thing to find and I've just kind of stumbled all across them randomly, so I don't really know. Do I have to like wait for a bit with this one? Like actually pretend to read it. How long does this take a normal person to read? Is it over here? Why is she writing it? Why are you writing over there? Honestly, okay, that took me so long to find, but I find it on my own this time. So where's the rainbow fragment then? Or do I have to go find more books? Okay, so I've read two books. So is there another one? What? Do I have to go around the clouds and find another one? Please don't tell me I have to because that would be a long time. <sighs> Why do I have so much struggle with the books? Let me guess, you were able to find all my equipment again, right? Yeah, I was actually with no help from video this time. I knew I could trust you, Olympia. To make things even, I found another one of those rainbow fragments. Go ahead, take it. You found a rainbow fragment. I did. Well, you did. And you gave it to me and then I passed it back to you. So, technically we found the rainbow fragment. There's no more books, is there? I've read them all. Oh, there's another one. Why have you put your books across the entire Cloud Kingdom? So, is that it? Is that all the books I have to read? Yeah, my Cause Journal Week 2. Okay, that is all the books I have to read. Thank God goodness because i am so done with reading these books i hate them because i can't find them usually and then i'm stuck running around for ages because i can't work it out or i have to search it up and i don't really want to search it up because i like playing through them and working it out on my own so I, it gets really annoying when i have to search it up because i can't find them what did you think i thought your books were very hard to find why are you putting them everywhere we're missing the seventh fragment. I think I've looked everywhere. Do you have any ideas, Olympia? Well, we've looked in the Moreland Forge. So possibly Silver Grey Manor or Steve's farm. I thought of that and called them whilst you were in Jorvik. They searched the area but didn't find anything. There she is, the most darling niece in the world. Hey, you two look like you just, you've just you just seen a druid. What's with the long faces? <clears throat> My voice is going, okay. Uncle Nick, you startled me. It's so good to see you. What brings you all the way out to D of Dino Valley to come up into the clouds? Well, Micah, I was just enjoying my travels when I stumbled across something quite interesting, the likes of which I've never seen before. This discovery reminded me of all those wonderful adventures we've had, and the object is something I only wish we'd found together. I figured the next best thing was for me to bring it to you. You see, I know how much you love rainbows, and this stone, well, take a look. <gasps> the seventh fragment! Um, you've already made this discovery? Yes, by the light of 18, we have so much to tell you and show you. Finally. Restore the blue. There we go. Rayo Cloud Kingdom is back to how it was. This experience kind of combined archaeology and magic, wouldn't you think so, Uncle Nick? We had to discover objects that are not unlike Druid runestones. Druid runestones. Druid runestones. Druid runestones. We've analysed together and then used those magic objects to heal the Cloud Kingdom. A very astute observation, Micah. Have you two developed any theories as to why this happened? I'm still scratching my head over it. Olympia found a ghostly girl playing her violin on Jorvik. Bold as anything. When she went away, she left a recording of her, of her music in her place. She called herself Katya. She was definitely pushing some kind of spell on the weather, but as for the missing colours in Cloud Kingdom, we have no proof she was involved. Katya, you say? That name rings a bell, but no, it can't be, can it? Whoever she is, it sounds like her arrival and the draining of colours from Cloud Kingdom is no coincidence. Whether or not it was intentional of her is a whole other matter. Olympia, what do you think? Well, it was definitely intentional. Katia claimed bad things happened whenever she, whether she wore them or not. Katia said people called her curse and I couldn't possibly know what that feels like. Well, we'll go with the first one. Curses? Cold? Hello, does this make me anyone make me think... Hello, does anyone make the, anyone else think of the eye switch from Isendale? Well... Yeah. Is this Katia cursed? Is she the eye switch? Ah, that old tale. An interesting one indeed. Let me think. 
Legend has it that the Ice Witch was born in medieval times and over the years practiced benevolent magic until for mis mysterious reasons she slipped into a rage and left the moors of dark witchcraft consume her, or so the story goes. I wondered though, like many legends, was she one person or many strong women woven into one story? Did she shut herself off from this world or was she trapped by those who feared her? I remember reading about an expedition in the late 1800s to search for Isendale for the evidence of this fabled ice witch, but there were no report of them returning home. You know what this means, right, Uncle Nick? This, that this has to be our next adventure. Next time I'm back on this land, we venture to Isendale. I will have a long think about and hard about that, Micah. For now, let's celebrate the success of you and Olympia here on Cloud Kingdom. All's well that ends well, or so we can hope. So that's based off, like, the ice uh the ice witch story um let me just think about this uh it's based off the snow queen or something and like the idea that it's many strong women merged into one is a very interesting idea uh because one woman can't live forever so and that's a very interesting idea to have it like go all the way down you know also ice and Dell sounds very similar to arendelle and you know of the the very famous movie that came out in 2013 yep that one i suppose they were like well we can't really deny the deny the similarities so we're just going to play off them <laughs> so i guess i think that's it for everything in this update let me just check i don't think there's anything else but like okay so if you see here it says do you dare face off against katia again her eerie music is still causing chaos you may you must figure out how to stop the blizzard that's wreaking havoc on Jorvik. Maybe you'll find answer at a certain party. Which party? I think maybe that was the party. Also, you can't exchange these for anything, I found. I don't know if they fixed that, but they didn't work. I, I was exchanged like, the first time it worked and it just gave me something like a gemstone. That was really rubbish. Then after that, it didn't give me anything. So, should we see if they fixed it? Let's see if they fixed it. Oh, they did. I don't know if it's like you can get something really valuable out of it, but you could also just sell the thing, the tokens, and then you wouldn't have to. Then you could like actually get money. <laughs> you know, there's more money in the tokens than there is actually in whatever he gives you. If it gives you 100 horse XP, okay, I can get on board with that. And some food would be, is nice. It's just I don't really know if it's worth it because you could just sell these for much more than what you're getting. Anyway, I think that's everything that there is in this update. Uh, so, I was a bit disappointed, I think, with the whole Katia thing. I think they made it seem like she had a bigger part to play in this than she possibly did. And I don't really know what they meant with it, so I might look into that a bit more and we'll see. But, thank you very much for watching this video. Anyway, if you enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel. And follow my Instagram, Olympia.peacechild. Follow my Twitch, Olympia Peace Child, and I shall see you in the next next video. Bye!